Hey everybody, it's Bono63 Sinotag. I'm here with a local scrapbook store um, buy and a small um, Dollar Tree um, buy. I just want to show you what I got. Um, I got some yellow cardstock, some white, and some pink to make chicks and rabbits, the little um, treat holders. I bought some more of the Tombow uh, brush markers they actually pretty good um, I was really surprised that they were re actually really really good I already have a bunch of them every time I go in I buy five so new markers I'm sure the ones at home that I haven't used them forever are drying up still I wish I could buy some more Copics but you know it's all right she, my local store didn't carry it so then she carries every single line of the graphic 45 and so I got a few of them um this first one is a garden one. I don't know uh, the name of it. <laughs> I thought it'd be on the paper, to be honest with you. So I'm just going to show you how pretty this beautiful paper is. It's really, really nice. Isn't that beautiful, those colors? I think this is the one of the month of the year, maybe. Yep, that's what I'm thinking it is. Just beautiful paper. Just love it. Look at that. I love sunflowers. Oh, Secret Garden. I guess that's what this is. Maybe. Give or take. Someone tell me. Um, but yeah. Isn't it beautiful? Isn't that just a beautiful... Can you not see that on a large um, mini album? Oh my gosh. That's just... Ugh. I'll probably go back and buy more. It's so neat. The story on this um, local store is the owner had a heart attack and they were thought they were going to shut down the store because um, she is still recovering. So everyone that's working there and covering the store are volunteering. Nobody's getting paid. They're all volunteering now. That is what I call a community. Don't you think so? So that's that. Beautiful colors. And then, this is topography. Um, we've all seen it, know it. Um, I made JB's um, Ancestry book out of it, and I thought, I want it for me too. So these are the ones I picked. I think I got two of, maybe, might have gotten two of each. And it turned out to be such a beautiful book. Um, and I mean, just perfect for it. Because um, it's history. And I did, I bought, there's about four of those. Uh, I know why, because I made the covers out of those, that's why. And I just bought some more of the um, cards. And I used them, um, it was just a great paper line to use them in the history book, ancestry book, I should say, which is history. All right, and then these are the months of the year um, one. There's December. Isn't that beautiful? I mean, they really do do a great job with their um, paper. I know you've all seen this. This is why I'm just going through it to show you. So I hope I'm going to make an album for the whole year and be able to use this paper. And I probably won't get to it till I get home. I'm leaving here the 29th of April. And then I don't know if I'm going to Ohio again or where, but I know that I go somewhere if, if by June. <laughs> so I would love to go back out to the West Coast, but with my mom being so ill, um, there's just no way I got to stay close to the um, East Coast. Isn't that pretty? I love pink and green. Anyway. So I got every month, um, beautiful paper. I want, I can tell you how much money this costs. <laughs> uh, I'm actually ashamed to say, and we're almost done. Um, springtime, it's still winter time here in Wisconsin. Uh, we just had snow today again, very light, but we still had it. Um, and I think we're going to clear out for a couple days. They have it in a couple days next week for some snow, but who knows? Maybe it's warming up. 
Everybody's sick and tired of hearing me say, ooh, snow, love it. <laughs> and I'm sick. And my manager today goes, that's what happens when you like snow. <laughs> it was hilarious. All right, now this is, I guess, French country something. I don't know. But I love um, love this look. So I bought some of those to make a small mini. It's really pretty. My, um, our house is French country. So... It goes perfectly with it. That's really pretty, isn't it? So, all the colors I like. There's the chicken. So, yeah. And there. And that would be the cover of, of the album. And there. So, that's all the paper that I got. Um, thanks for staying with me and watching that through. And then I got some dominoes. I'm hoping it's only on one side. I haven't even opened it. Um, this is at the Dollar Tree. Here, I'll let you look at that while I try to tear it open and see. Because I've never, um, I think I might have decorated it in one domino, I think. But these are the smaller ones. Yeah, they're on both sides, so you'd have to, you know, um, just some of them and get them. But cute size, really cute size. The thin ones, I like them, so I bought them. Then, I was amazed to find an acrylic block and stamps at the Dollar Tree. Sorry about the glare. Um, this one's Hello with some flowers, and this is a birthday one. That'll work. And it's a birthday one. I don't have anything birthday here, so I thought, whew, Dollar Tree, I'll take it. Then... I found just a couple of these, um, the raised uh, lettering, and I liked them, so I got two of them. I got this notebook, uh, especially since it had a binding closure, and I think I'm going to make this kind of a cross between um, a scripture and just a quote book to inspire, so that's what I'm going to do with that. And lastly, my bright shining light. Um, I saw these, um, photo albums, you know, the photo albums that you put kids' pictures in? If you remember, um, over Christmas, I made some great, um, mini albums out of them. I got the idea from Amber, who's a lyric lover. Um, I forgot her number is 819, it's something out there, but it's Amber, I'm sure you all know who I'm talking about. Um, and I bought some more of them so I can make some while I'm here. So there you go, my huge stack of graphic 45 paper and a few goodies from the Dollar Tree. So I hope this video finds all of you well. I hope you're going to have a great weekend. I'm going to do a lot of uh, traveling over the, the uh, island and just look, checking out things I haven't been able to see. And then I might craft on Sunday. So that's my plan. I hope everyone's doing well and I wish you all a good night. Bye.